Hello. Beards and hairy men seem to be in these days. You look through fashion magazines and websites and you see beards everywhere. Not necessarily nicely trimmed ones, but uh, big scary things that uh, creep up from underneath the shirt collar and possibly take their roots in chest hair. Some of the models even have unibrows. That's like we're putting suits on Neanderthals. Let's not forget that just a few years ago, men were being portrayed as boyish and androgynous in fashion adverts. Even the girls were being portrayed the same way. Sometimes you weren't sure what you were looking at. Neither of these extremes is right for a gentleman. Let's just say that there are thresholds. One of them is being too hairy and uncivilized. And another one is being too boyish, too immature. Don't misunderstand me, this isn't a diatribe against facial hair. There are many men who look quite distinguished with beards. Facial hair, if done right, can be one of those elements that helps you look like a gentleman. Whether you then are a gentleman depends on a multitude of other factors, the scope of which is beyond this one video. The take-home message here is that gentlemen aren't influenced by fads. They're guided by the classics, by what has stood the test of time, by what is generally considered to be elegant and refined. When it comes to facial hair, that may mean a multitude of styles. The key here being a solid integration with the rest of that gentleman's personal look. Whatever style of facial hair is chosen, it should be nicely trimmed and cared for. And a certain amount of restraint should be shown where its length is concerned. You should take a close and honest look in the mirror and see what works for you. Perhaps meet with a trusted style advisor. You are welcome to experiment till you find exactly what works for your face, your wardrobe, and your lifestyle. Because let's face it, a big hairy beard paired with a t-shirt usually spells sloppy and disheveled. On the other hand, a nicely groomed beard paired with a suit can make you look distinguished. For me, a full beard is out. I may look interesting with one, but it itches like crazy and I can't relax with it. On the other hand, something different than a beard. Perhaps a pair of chops like the ones I'm sporting now might offer a, an interesting look and also be different from the current fads of big hairy beards. Or you could always rely on the tried and true classic of a nicely shaven face. That's how my wife loves to see me. Bottom line, guide yourself on what works for you. Keep the classics in mind. And if you have a spouse or a significant other, pay close attention to their feedback. Till next time, I'm Rahul Pop.